what's going on YouTube? My name is Kun Ninja Guy. Today I'm bringing you a tutorial on advanced masking in Adobe After Effects. Um, I use CS6, but you can do this I think all the way back to CS4 and 3. But um, I motion tracked this using the built-in camera tracker and I just heard a little bleep. What the fuck? Oh, it's my pick! Ah! Shoot! Steven Jackson! Draft! Alright, I did not know it was my pick again. I'm sorry guys, I, I'm in a fantasy draft right now, and I'm picking random people. I don't know anything about football, I don't, I, I do, I just don't pay attention to it this early in the season. But um, there's a troll face track right there, um, but if I click back, it looks like, see it's behind the door, so it's not actually in the, uh, it's not actually in the frame yet. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go through the first frame, so like, you fully cannot see the, uh, the window. Nodes frame by frame. I heard a beeping. I was like, wait a minute, what was that? So, uh, come on. One more frame. I think two more frames is perfect. Uh, let's go one more. Oh, oh, yep, that, that one's good. Alright, so go to this frame right here. So, this is the first time, like, it's, like, you cannot see the window at all. So, what you want to do is click, um, my composition, which I mash the keyboard for the name, and turn out the pen tool for a mask. Click around the layer. And make sure you click right there. Click around the doorway. So click corner, and then click up. Okay, so I have a mask. Uh, what I'm gonna do? Go to mask, mask path, keyframe that, and change the mode to subtract. So now, when I go back to this, uh, I want to change the mask path. If I go frame forward, I can drag. The, well, no. Okay, I like this. There we go. So now I can drag the point to my liking. So if I go frame forward. Frame forward, did it even go frame forward? I can't even tell. Yes it did. So then I need to match the doorway for every single frame. It is a very tedious process, but it turns out a lot better in the end. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to time lapse this and I'll uh, you know start talking again right at like around the last frame. So yeah, see you then. Alright guys, so I am nearing the end of making this all perfect and sexy. So basically, you know, it is a very tedious process. What I do advise, I should have said this earlier, but um, uh, put it on f full so that you can get the most precise track you can. Uh, I should have done this earlier. I had it on a quarter because I was previewing something. Because um, I do not have the best GPU. I have an old thing. This My, my computer was state-of-the-art in 2008, but this is 2012 now, so it's not even close to state-of-the-art. But um, as you'll see, I am nearing the end, and like for the last few frames, and you, the doorway is basically completely out of sight. Um, you can try keyframing it for the last ones, and you don't even really need to track it at the end, uh, or uh, mask it at the end, my bad. And so, see, if I do play through these last frames, I can go as long as, look, I can keep going like this, keep going, keep going, keep going, and that track is perfectly fine. The mask will not interfere anymore. I think it's my pick in that fantasy draft. Stop, like, hey. All right, so I'll go back to court if I can see you get through. See, so if I play through the mask, it's perfectly fine now. Um, it does show up, and I go back here, and it does not show up behind the wall. So that's really all you need in this uh, tutorial. Uh, if you enjoyed, hit that like button below, subscribe button up top. And I'll, it helps me out a ton. Uh, thank you guys for watching. My name is Cool Ninja Guy, and I'm out. Adios.